Well, we have an exclusive report. A Warner Brothers employee came forward and blew the whistle on the fact that InfoWars is now being censored at Warner Brothers. That's right. Warner Brothers does not want their employees to visit InfoWars.com. Well, we can see why. I mean, they are part of the machine. Warner Brothers is part of the machine that's continuously trying to dumb people down and, you know, and continue the leftist propaganda line, you know, the globalist agenda. So it's no wonder that they don't want their employees listening to Alex Jones. Let's take a look at these screenshots that this person sent who wants to remain anonymous, which we can understand why. Uh, this is really funny. It says suffering succotash, you know, because that's Warner Brothers right there. The page you have requested has been blocked because it may contain content inappropriate for the workplace. So, yes, this is InfoWars. You can see up here at the top that it says InfoWars.com. And now the person goes on to say in this message, says, I work for Warner Brothers Studios in Redacted. I listen to Alex Jones show every day. Today I came into work and found that Warner Brothers has blocked internet access to InfoWars for Warner Brothers employees. I can send a screenshot. I am guessing that Alex would want to know. Well, yes, we do want to know. So anytime you guys experience something like this, send it to us. Let us know because we want to put the word out that there is like a systematic um, creeping of censorship going on in this nation right now. And we've been seeing it with Facebook and social media how there's like this slow creeping in of censoring people and trying to specifically target people like InfoWars. Another comment from the source, FYI, it has been at least six years since I've encountered a URL block at work. So this is not something that just occurs occasionally. By my experience, and I am all over the internet on my breaks every day, Twitter, Breitbart, Drudge Report, shopping, etc. Another coworker confirmed, that he also got the InfoWars block. That's right. Have you got the InfoWars block yet? <laughs> because it seems as though that's the thing that's next around the corner on social media, Twitter, and so on and so forth. Well, this is just another fine example of censorship here in the United States of America. This is Millie Weaver for the InfoWars Nightly News.